In Greensboro, people who use the public bus system are frustrated after GTA bus drivers went on strike for a few hours this morning. WXI 12's Louis Tran joins us live from the bus depot in Greensboro with the latest. Louis? Hey, Christine. The company that hires the bus drivers called RATP Dev USA tells me that the delay was caused by a misunderstanding of medical benefits. The city of Greensboro tells me that they first learned about this at 7 this morning, but operations began at 1130 again. But many passengers we spoke with this morning are very frustrated. At 746 this morning, the city of Greensboro announced that all GTA buses were not running due to a lack of operators. A spokesman for the city, Jay Keyes, tells me that the paratransit service, however, was still running. He says the city is still confirming the details behind the delay, but he did confirm with me that all 19 bus routes began at 5.30 this morning, but 12 of them stopped at 6.30. He says all bus drivers are contractors. They all work for a company called RAP, RATP Dev USA. The global company has been operating in the U.S. for more than 50 years, but it began working in Greensboro since July. We talked with a number of passengers this morning who were frustrated after getting stuck at the bus depot. They're going to go on strike. They shouldn't have picked nobody up. It's people down here with small babies. They shouldn't have picked nobody up. They should have did what they had to do on their own. You don't put nobody else in effect when you were trying to get what you're going to get. They should not pick us up this morning. They should have picked nobody up. I done missed a whole day out of work, and I want my money, just like they want their money. I have a family feed, just like they have a family feed. I reached out to RATP Dev USA to get the response. They sent me a statement and reads in part, quote, Many drivers were delayed in operating their schedules after a misunderstanding over medical benefit costs on a first day of open enrollment benefits coverage because of the misunderstanding. RATP Dev USA management took additional time to provide employees clarity of the benefit enhancements. Now, if you did pay for your bus service and did not receive service, call the number that's on your screen. That's 336-335-6499. You'll get a bus pass or credit. And here's something very, uh, interesting to note as well. RATP Dev USA has a five-year contract with the city of Greensboro since last July, and it's going to begin, begin since last July. In Greensboro, I'm Louis Tran, WXII 12 News.